As Mike and Mara Sudik make their way through the autograph line at this year's Community Day, an important member of their family isn't with them. So it's kind of you know, special for us to be here this time. It's in, in memory of Teresa. Teresa Sudik loved going to the race. She enjoyed meeting the drivers more. She was diagnosed with ovarian cancer at Christmas. Teresa's father, Mike, says her first surgery didn't go well. First operation wasn't real successful. The second operation was risky and she didn't uh, come out of it. She was on life support and we had to take her off life support. She died on Valentine's Day. Teresa Sudik was 30 years old. The Sudik family has been coming to the big race since 1969. They've missed just three races since moving from Indianapolis to Philadelphia. With the death of their daughter, Teresa, they thought about not coming to the race this year. Thankfully, they did. On the back of this year's 500 Festival Community Day Outlook pamphlet, their daughter, Teresa, doing her favorite thing during race week, getting driver autographs. P people who don't believe in that stuff, it's coincidence. T to us, it's she's, here. She, she's, she's still here racing with us. Dario Franchitti and Scott Dixon were two of Teresa's favorite drivers. Both men were moved as they heard Teresa's story and what their autograph means to the family's healing process. They were just so nice to her. It just made her life. The family used Photoshop to superimpose their daughter into pictures with all of her favorite drivers. Her parents say it's what Teresa would have wanted. This is what we do as a family and we'll continue doing it. We just find a different way to do it with her in our memory. Joe LePage, Fox 59 News.